my camera might not be very good I want you to hit that subscription button and that subscription button will determine a lot how far this journey will go because I have issues with the way I see things being done I might not be the right one maybe neither you can be the right one today I want to talk about uh, investment opportunities in Africa as somebody who is coming from West Western Europe or from North America Africa is big Africa has diversity it's not exploited they have taken away the materials but they have not finished they have taken away administration and put the puppets in Africa as a leopard the only lucrative business that you can do in Africa and succeed I'll mention maybe five or six sectors I know if you venture into those sectors as a wee part definitely you'll actually have returns that you're expecting to get first of all you must know the region very well and look at the World Bank investment and political IDEX ratings you cannot invest in a country that is in what on a situation political instability tribal clashes ethnic you know division and all those things uh, where there is political instability or where the colonial masters are still taking hostage of the middle class and pocketing their rights and ensuring they own the economy when you go to such an environment definitely there's no money you need to look at the history of an institution of the country where you want to settle because you're coming as an investor not a job seeker in Africa there are no jobs you want an opportunity to invest your money those are the priorities to look into number two look at the technology in the area of your interest if it's a farming agriculture agri farming look at the farming techs that are in place in that particular place if it is real rested look at how they develop the real rested if it's banking sector look at the IT infrastructure and the banking act and what the constitution of that country says as a foreigner or as a, as a comeback leopard these are the things you need to put into consideration another thing now I want to highlight on the most lucrative businesses you can do in Africa and succeed if you observe those things I have mentioned earlier on then this is yours real estate development this is one of the most and the fastest growing industry in Africa but this real estate development it's a capital draining engagement that requires you to have huge input flows and slow output flows what do I mean by this you need to have a lot of money you invest into estates development buying chunk of land and getting the right contractor do the work for you you get the attorney you start selling your houses or you start leasing them out this is one of the fastest growing sector in Africa you cannot finish the opportunities in this area of economy development the second one is agriculture agriculture is wide you can venture into horticultural production 
production I mean processing and export or you can go to farming getting the land cultivating the land putting the seedlings on the ground watering them until harvest you can do six months or three months season seasonal farming in Africa this one you will never go wrong it will always be number one on the list food is needed for export and for local consumption and the African government they are offering subsidies in particular to commercial farmers the third one is telecommunication and infrastructure development in Africa this one if you have the money medium small enterprises as an entrepreneur distribution of the bad with satellite connectivity for consumer enterprises you will always be number one money will always be there what you need to do is to look at the competition look at the level of the tech penetration in the country of your interest and then you get the attorney and business investment consultant you establish your entity and you click the other one but not the least uh, is uh, transport and logistics transport and logistics involves creating and forwarding shipping of consignments and logistics this you will reap big money if you have the capacity to roll it out like ups but inland transportation of cargo you can use the trucks or invest in a public service interest area you can make money the other one is manufacturing small medium enterprise manufacturing you can pack milk you can pick coffee and process it and export it you can manufacture plastics small consumable metal components for different aspects of diverse, diverse engineering areas this area you it will cost you maybe less than 500,000 US dollars and you create a, a, a year return of maybe 4 to 5 million US dollars to 100 million dollars depending on the region let's focus on these areas I've given you the critical areas requirements and the prerequisite requirements focus on those things and you never go wrong hit that subscription button I'll come later with more precise and detailed requirements on how to go about these endeavors support this channel it's your channel it will take you far it will enlighten you on what you're supposed to do my camera is not good I'm using a phone you are the one who's gonna help me to buy the 3d or 5d camera by subscribing to this channel listen to these debates I'm putting forward because they are debates that can transform your minds and make you realize your goals right here in Africa Chinese have taken over we need to counter check them by asking our governments to give a subsidy and instead of creating competition in the name of creating employment for foreign capital direct investment they can offer that to 
the blacks in Caribbeans, in North America, in Europe. They have the capacity to do this work. What they need is mentorship and uh, being given detailed criteria on what is needed and how to go about it. The rest they can do. The rest they can do. That is not a look at science. It's not a look at science. Help me with subscription. I have a target of reaching a hundred people this month. If you know you are watching this video, whenever you are, don't hesitate to click on the channel and see what is there. It is something that is lucrative because the West has fallen. Right now, there's nothing you can do in America. It's already oversaturated. And as a black person, the investment there, you don't pull a lot of profit. The only place where you can pull this profit is in Africa. It's in Africa. So if it is in Africa, so why should you hesitate to think of uh, wasting your, or freezing your cash in a white man's world? Bring the money in Africa, but bring money in Africa in a legitimate way, not money rounding, in a way that is so fortified within the regulatory framework in a, accordance to the constitution of a particular region you want to have interest on. Because that way, you will go very far and you will have what you call fundamental basis. Good relations with the communities of your interest surrounding the area where you want to do the business is very critical. I'm saying this on a very serious note. I have an experience. I know how to go about this. What I need to do is just to organize yourself. Make sure you do the right thing, the right praise. Have a good day.